Uh, also, there's something uh, called network effects. This is a uh, Metcalf's law. Uh, Metcalf's law basically says that the more people use a product, the more valuable it becomes. So for Apple, you've got iMessage, you've got the AirDrop, you've got FaceTime, and you eventually over time just get trapped inside the ecosystem. So what I noticed is that a lot of these tech companies, they're trying to build these walled gardens, these ecosystems. Microsoft has an ecosystem. You know, they've got their own little like Microsoft Teams and they got their own email stuff going on. They got their own search engine, stuff like that. Uh, and then you know, Apple has an ecosystem. Google has an ecosystem. So a lot of these companies, their goal is to get you into their walled garden, get you into their ecosystem. And Apple's done a really good job of getting people into their ecosystem. And in fact, Apple was beefing with Facebook because Mark Zuckerberg got upset because Apple was not letting developers have access to the data that they needed for Facebook to be able to really fine tune its advertising um, strategy, right? So, so they can't get the data that advertisers want uh, so they can run their ad system. So he put out a full page ad in the New York Times criticizing Apple, attacking Apple. And every time he talks about Apple, he says something nasty about them. Like he'll say, you know, they haven't innovated anything since Steve Jobs was alive, which is actually true. 